Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Mario Party 4. Probably gonna be my last video for tonight. Just for the fact I'm getting tired now. And I'm losing this game. No, I'm truly am losing this game, but not. You know what I mean. See, this is what I mean. You, you're you're going to lose if you're stuck in the freaking middle. Me and Yoshi stand no chance. And somehow I win. If you're in the middle, you basically stand no chance. I know that just like went against what I said, but seriously, you don't. This, these AI are just cheap. I'm just going to say that now. They're cheap. They're unpredictable. But anyways. Um, yeah. Last video for today. Um, hopefully tomorrow this let's play will be done. I'm going to look into some things for this game. Explain some things for the last video. Bonuses and stuff. Stuff you can do if you get the game. I don't recommend that you do. This isn't the best. Personally, I think number two was the best. It's, it's very interesting that the levels they were they were very different, and they weren't like level edits and the paths and stuff. They looked great. The worlds were very different. I mean, you had like a pirate theme. You had Bowser theme with the volcano and stuff, you had a ghost theme, you had a wild west theme, you had, I think you had a beach theme too, you just had a whole bunch of stuff there, and you even had like a, an alien architect explorer theme, and it, it was very good, unlike this, this is very boring, I'm seriously, this isn't the best, this, I think this might be the worst, in my opinion the worst serious in my opinion this has got to be the worst of them I mean just look at it number two had a very big variety of games of mini games this one we've we've seen repeats of this so many times in this damn let's play and we still haven't even unlocked everything. It's it's amazing. It's just it's amazing. It's just we haven't even unlocked everything here and it's just not a very good one. Number four isn't good. It's a letdown. Just like something else on my channel. Five turns left. So definitely, probably tomorrow. Come on, land on Donkey Kong so I can... See, th 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 that thing is impossible. No one ever wins it. I wonder if there's even a video up on YouTube that shows someone winning it. Oh, I'm gonna lose this round too, because this game sucks. Preferably you wanna play the game um with friends and stuff. Really you should. I have already experienced that. I will state that in the review when I do this game for a review. But um yeah, it's not really a first per uh, player game but I have already experienced it with other people. It's much better, but well, it's not that much. Let's just say it's slightly. It, the, the levels, like, they don't change when you play with other people. You, do you expect that? No. So they don't change. They're not very cool. They're, to me, basically level edits. <laughs> big fat level edits with the gimmick of the area traded out and that's it 
goes in the same general direction. I know that it's circular. I know all of them have to go in a circular motion, but what I mean by circular is that literally the map is almost like a damn circle. Seriously. Number two, you could like go through like like cool things. I mean, there's there's so many stuff, so much stuff you could do in number two. So much better stuff than this. This one isn't fun. And why am I doing number four and not the other ones? Well, because I want to do them in order. I always want to do my shit in chrono uh, chronological order. It makes more sense and it's not as confusing when you watch a video. See, look at this. Two, ver two versus two mini games, and we only have a three game selection. Right there. I know there's more, but there's only about like six or so. You, you, you do realize how many times we've played this fucking game, and it's so damn boring. That's it. At the end of this turn right here, I will go show you at the end, and that will be the end of this video. And you'll see what, exactly what I mean by it's very boring. And have such a tiny amount of games That's amazing. Not really. I've gotten higher. I hit 400 before. I know, ain't I an expert? Alright. Now I will show you what the hell I mean by small, tiny, tiny amount of games. Mini game mode. See, I don't like how you select stuff in this. It's not cool. I don't, I, I, well, never mind. It's different, but it's kind of weird. Um, hmm. You know what, wait a minute, I don't even know how the fuck I'm supposed to view this. Ah, right, here we go. Look at this. Twelve... There is completely sixteen games. That is not a lot. Did, I swear that the second one had at least like twenty-four games or something like that. And we're missing... Look, look how many, like, stuff we have, like, repeated. We've repeated so much. I mean, we've we haven't e we've only played photo finish like once. We've completed three th throw like three times. We've done that just like once. See, it's not it's not cool. It's very repeated. And then and then you get like secret mini games or something like that games are repeated it's not cool at all there's only nine one verse three games that's horrible you should always usually have them at least equaled up to have some variety because we do repeat a lot of shit we've only played this game once the first damn game we actually played in this let's play I think six battle things see it all depends on the damn mode like Two verse two, one verse three, and four player games. I can. You need to have more than what the hell that are listed right there. I mean. I mean, two verse two and one verse three are equaled up to nine nine games, and we've got them all in two verse two, but they're not very. F a couple of them are fun. And some are easy, like that one, right or right or left. Very stupid. It's a bullshit game. 
but yeah, you need to have a lot more. I'd say at least like 20 games per for four player, one versus three or two versus two. Now, battle on the other hand, I'd say at least 10. I mean, you can slightly understand right now of why there's a low number. And this is because, well, you ain't going to land on the battle thing very much, and you only get to pick two. So, if the game would please be programmed to where it would have a much higher damn chance to choose the fucking question mark ones that you don't know. Because that would be so helpful to unlock it all. Because we're on the third damn game and haven't even unlocked them all. Now Bowser definitely needs more, at least five. We've hit Bowser spaces a lot, maybe at least eight times. They were these two, and they're very boring. Well, no, they were fun. Never mind, they were fun. I'm just saying boring because this game's pissing me off. But they were. You need more of a selection story I forget everything with story and stuff like that I might check that out before I do a review but yeah as you can see level designs are not very cool and not enough mini games to play you need more this game was definitely a letdown stuff was in a circle but yeah, I will continue and finish this game, and when it's done, I will do a game review for it. I know it sounds like I'm bashing the game. I sort of am, but it was a disappointment, in my opinion. Remember, this is all in my opinion. But yeah. This is truth, and I will see you guys tomorrow, and hopefully this game will be done. But you can only find out unless you watch, so stay tuned.